Regardless of the name, black holes are everything but empty space. Imagine a star 10 times more massive than the Sun, compressed into a sphere with a diameter roughly equal to that of New York City. The consequence is a gravitational field so powerful that not even light can escape. Typically, astronomers hunt for black holes using non-visible wavelengths or by detecting their influence on nearby objects. Recently, a group of astronomers led by researchers at the University of Alabama in Huntsville, UAH, consulted the Gaia Data Release 3, or DR3, and discovered a black hole in our galaxy's neighborhood. In their study, they say that this monster black hole is about 12 times as heavy as the Sun and is about 1,550 light years away from Earth. This black hole offers astrophysicists a unique opportunity because of its size and proximity. Astronomers are particularly interested in black holes because they provide unique possibilities to investigate fundamental physical principles in the most extreme environments. Some of them, like the supermassive black holes at the centers of most enormous galaxies, also play an important role in galaxy creation and development. Nevertheless, many mysteries remain about the role of non-interacting black holes in the development of galaxies. These black hole binaries are unique in that the black hole does not feed on its star partner. Researchers use data from the Gaia DR3, which includes observations of over 200,000 binary stars from the Gaia Observatory of the European Space Agency, to locate the black hole. The group investigated potential sources further by referencing spectrographic observations from other telescopes, such as the Automated Plant Finder at Lick Observatory, the Giant Magellan Telescope, or GMT, and the WM Keck Observatory in Hawaii. These measurements showed a main sequence star subject to a powerful gravitational force. As they are closer in orbits and may thus suck more material from their star partners, interacting black holes are more likely to be observable in the visible spectrum. The material is pushed to relativistic speeds near the speed of light, becoming very energetic and releasing X-ray radiation as it forms a torus-shaped accretion disk around the black hole. The existence of a non-interacting black hole must be deducted from the movements of the observable star due to the black hole's larger orbit and inability to generate such disks. The methods that were used to find this black hole could help us find many more systems that don't interact with each other. Somewhere about a million of the stars in our galaxy are thought to be accompanied by enormous black holes. It is true that this is just a small percentage of the galaxy's total stellar population, 100 billion stars, but the accurate measurements made by the Gaia Observatory have significantly restricted the search. Over a billion celestial objects, including as stars, galaxies, and quasars, have had their locations and proper movements catalogued by Gaia thus far. Let us know what you think in the comments section below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, check out our previous videos, and visit our website if you love reading at www.nasaspacenews.com. Thanks for watching.